Okay. I'm gonna live stream this so that I have a video to show my kids tomorrow. So this book is called This is How We Do It. One Day in the Lives of Seven Kids from Around the World by Matt Lamoth. So here's a partial world map. You can see where all of the kids are from. This whole thing is Russia. Right here is Japan. Right here is India. Right here is Iran. Right there, that little shoe shape is Italy. Right there, that's Uganda in Africa. And right over here is Peru in South America. Um, Hawaii is right there with these dots. That's us. This is the author. He's from Chicago, which is all the way over there. But all of this is America. This is America. This is America. This is America. This is Canada. Yeah. This is How We Do It by Matt Lamoth. My name, oh, we'll start here. Italy. My name is Romeo. I'm called Mio. I am eight years old. Japan. My name is Kei. I'm called Kei-chan. I'm nine years old. Uganda. My name is Daphne and I'm called Abuli. I'm seven years old. Russia. My name is Olg. I'm called Oska. I'm eight years old. My name is Ribaldo. I'm called Pereino. I'm seven years old. Oh, Peru. I don't know if I said Peru. India. My name is Ananya. I'm called Anu. I'm eight years old. Iran. My name is Kian. I'm seven years old. This is where I live. So you can see all their different types of houses. Russia. So this is Olg's house. I live in a second floor apartment in Uchili, a mining town near the Ural Mountains. Peru. I live in a... So this is... Yeah. Can you guys see? I just realized it's blurry. So this is Ribaldo's house. It says, I live in a house my father built in Los Naranjos, a village in the Amazon rainforest. Japan. So this is Kei's house. I live in a house in the metropolis of Tokyo, one of the largest cities in the world. Uganda. So this is Daphne's house. Oh, it's blurry. I live in a house made of wood and mud in the village of Kanyawara. Italy. So this is Romeo's house. I live in a house in the village of Codronano with a vineyard in my backyard. So a vineyard is where they make wine. Iran. So this is Kian's house. I live in a second floor apartment in the city of Gorgon, close to the Caspian Sea. India, so this is Ananya's house. I live in a first floor apartment in the northern city of Hardewa, ha, Haridwa, along the fast flowing Ganges River. This is who I live with. Iran. So this is Kian. I live with my mom, Masha, my dad, Mohammed, and my little brother, Aaron. India. So this is Ananya's house. I live with my mom, Shivi, my dad, Mohit, and my younger sister, Anika. Japan. So this is Kechan. I live with my mom, Yuki, my dad, Dai, and my younger sister, Nao. Italy, so this is Romeo. 
I live with my mom, Francesca, my dad, Oscar, my big brother, Ugo, and my older sister, Mila. Peru. So this is Ribaldos. I live with my mom, Sofia, my dad, Isais, my younger brothers, Nasir and Eber, and my little sister, Neida. I also have four older siblings who don't live with us. Uganda. So this is Daphne. I live with my mom, Beatrice, my dad, Peter, and my older brother, Roger. And Russia. So this is Olg's family. I live with my mom, Katya, my dad, Albert, and my younger brother, Artem. This is what I wear to school. Japan. This is K. I choose my own clothes for school. I like striped dresses and fancy socks. Iran, so this is Kian. I wear a uniform that has a jacket with a built-in shirt collar. Italy, so this is Romeo. I wear different clothes every day, but my favorite is the dinosaur sweater. Peru, so this is Ribaldo. We don't have a uniform. I usually wear trousers, a t-shirt, and a belt with a lion buckle. Okay. India, so this is Ananya's house, or Ananya's uniform. My uniform includes a special ID card I wear like a necklace. Russia, so this is Olg's uniform. Boys are required to wear a black suit, white shirt, and tie but I get to pick out the socks. Uganda, so this is Daphne's. We all dress in red shirts and green shorts for school. This is what I eat for breakfast. I ran, so this is Kian. I have a babari bread, eggs, feta cheese, walnuts, and tea with sugar. Peru, so this is Ribaldos. I have fried rice with chicken and peppers, sliced boiled plantains, and hot milk. Plantains are like bananas. Uganda. I have matoke with meat, bread, eggs, and milk. So this is Daphne's breakfast. Italy. So this is Romeo's breakfast. I have toast with Nutella spread, a cup of egg yolks mixed with sugar and milk, and tea. Russia, so this is Olg's. I have oat kasha with milk and butter, farmer cheese, bread, and apple juice. India, so this is Ananya's breakfast. I have paneer pata with tomato chutney and milk. Japan, so this is Kay's breakfast. I have rice with furikake, miso soup, grilled cod, and an orange wedge. This is how I go to school. Japan. So this is how Kay gets to school. I walk by myself along city streets, past houses and shops. I smell roasting coffee beans from a cafe. Say Ohio gazaimasu to the crossing guards. So there's Kay. Russia. So this is Olg. I walk past large apartment buildings, a mosque, a church, cats basking in the sun, and Mount Airy Mill far in the distance. Peru. So this is how Ribaldo gets to school. I walk next to the main road with my younger brothers and sister, sometimes stopping to buy a snack of sweet bread from a fruit stand. I ran. So this is how Kian gets to school. My mom or dad drives me in our car. We zoom past construction sites, office buildings, and people going to work. Italy. So this is how Romeo gets to school. I ride a school bus past rivers and canyons, grape and olive fields, sometimes spotting a shepherd and his sheep. Uganda. So this is how Daphne goes to school. I walk for half an hour with friends along a path, passed by slip bicyclists and groves of eucalyptus and banana trees. India, so this is how Anya, Ananya gets to school. My mom drives me and my friends in a van through busy streets past hotels, shops, and cows that freely roam the roads. 
This is my teacher, Uganda. So this is Daphne's teacher. I call my teacher Evelyn. She's been teaching for eight years. India, so this is Ananya's teacher. I call my teacher Atati Bathala Mam. She's been teaching for four years. Russia, so this is Olg's teacher. I call my teacher Svetlana Atolyevna. She's been teaching for 36 years. Peru, so this is Ribaldo's teacher. I call my teacher Professor Pedro. He's been teaching for 26 years. Japan. So this is Kay's teacher. I call my teacher Sensei. She's been teaching for 12 years. Italy. So this is Romeo's teacher. I call my teacher Luisa. She's been teaching for 20 years. Iran. So this is Kian's teacher. I call my teacher Konum Molem. She's been teaching for 6 years. This is how we learn. So India, so this is Kian's classroom. We study general awareness and value education as well as subjects like math, Hindi, and English. Japan, so this is Kay's classroom. We all wear our white indoor slippers and are in charge of cleaning our classroom every day. We study ethics as well as math, science, and Japanese. Peru, so this is Rivaldo's classroom. Our school is very small, so the 14 kids in 5th and 6th grade study in the same room. We have different subjects each day, and our school ends at 1 o'clock. Russia, so this is Og's classroom. I study three languages, Russian, English, and Bashkir. I'm in a class with the same kids and the same teacher from 1st through 4th grade. Uganda, so this is Daphne's classroom. I study at a private school far from home, so I stay with my grandma who has a house nearby. There are 69 boys and girls in my class. We study math, reading, writing, and religion. Iran, so this is Kian's school. I go to an all boys school. We study reading and writing in Farsi, math, science, and the Quran. Italy, so this is Romeo's school. We do many activities outside the classroom, like visit parks and forests, go to museums in other cities, and put on a musical at the end of the year. We have school from 8 o'clock to 4 o'clock. This is how I spell my name. Russia, so this is Olga. Olga. I write in Russian using the Cyrillic alphabet. Peru, so this is Ribaldos. I write in Spanish using the Latin alphabet. Iran, so this is Kiran. Kir, Kians. I write in Farsi using the Persian alphabet. Does that look like Kian? Japan, so this is K's. I write in Japanese using kanji characters. Uganda, so this is Daphne. I write in Rutoro and English using the Latin alphabet. India, so this is Ananyas. I write in Hindi using the Devangari alphabet. Italy, so this is Romeo's. I write in Italian using the Latin alphabet. This is what I eat for lunch. Iran, so this is Kian's lunch. I have a das polo, fresh greens and herbs, salad with a tomato, cucumber, onion, and lime juice, and water. Peru, so this is Ribaldo's. I have white rice, beans, fried plantains, and coffee. Russia, so this is Olg's. I have barley kasha with butter, an open-faced sandwich with cheese, and tea with sugar. India, so this is Ananyas. I have chapati, okra, okra, a chocolate cookie, and water. 
Japan. So this is case. I have rice with chicken katsu, soup with cucumber, tofu, and seaweed, salad, and milk. Italy. So this is Romeo's. I have ravioli with sage and cheese and water. Uganda. So this is Daphne's. I have motoke with tomato sauce and water. This is how I play. Uganda. So Daphne. I like to jump rope with friends from school. Italy, so Romeo. I have rock throwing contests in the hills behind my house. Russia, so Olg. I play hockey with my team almost every day after school. India, so Ananyas. I gather with all my friends in the park to play Rumal Kor or Hanky Thief. Japan, so this is K. I play Kori Oni or freeze tag with friends on the playground by my house. Iran, so this is Kian. I go horseback riding with my friends at a nearby stable. Peru, so this is Robaldo. I play soccer with my two brothers and nephew on a field in the main road. This is how I help. Uganda. So Daphne, I sweep the courtyard with a broom. India. So Ananya, I hang wet laundry on the clothesline to dry. Italy. So Romeo, I feed our four cats and some wild ones that come into the backyard. Peru. So Ribaldo, I help tend to the cornfields our fam on our family farm. Russia, so Olg. I vacuum the floors and rugs. Iran, so Kian. I help take care of my little brother. Japan, so K. I help cook dinner. This is how we eat dinner. Iran, so this is K. On weekends, we all have dinner together. But on weekdays, it's just my mom, little brother, and me. We eat in the kitchen around 9 o'clock. A dinner of grilled chicken, salad with tomatoes and cucumbers, yogurt, and bread with water to drink. Russia, so this is Olg. We all eat together in the kitchen around 6 o'clock. A meal of salad, mashed potatoes, coletti with cheese sauce, my favorite, and bread. For dessert, my mom serves ola, oladi with condensed milk, cookies, and black tea. Italy. So this is Romeo. Sometimes during the week, my family eats separately, but we always eat together on the weekends. We gather at the kitchen table around 8 o'clock to eat lasagna with ragu, bolognese, and bechamel sauce. We drink peach iced tea and water. Uganda. So this is Daphne. My brother, mom, housemaid, and I usually eat dinner around 10 o'clock at night at our big wooden table. We have motoke with g-nut sauce and milk to drink. Japan. So this is Kay. I eat with my parents and little sister in the dining room around 7 o'clock. Our typical meal is fried salmon with tartar sauce, rice, salad with apples, cucumbers, and tuna, Tofu, miso soup, and milk or water to drink. India. So this is Ananya. My whole family eats together around 9 o'clock in our dining room. We have chutney, carrots, and potatoes, chapati, and yogurt with water to drink. Peru. So this is Ribaldo. My entire family gathers around 7 o'clock to eat a dinner of white rice, boiled yuca, and stewed chicken with coffee to drink. This is what I do in the evening. Russia. So this is Olg. I play chess with my dad. India. So Anya. My sister and I play a board game called Karom. Uganda. So this is Daphne. I relax with my family. Iran. So this is Kian. I watch cartoons on TV. Peru. So this is Ribaldo. 
I help my brother with his homework. Italy, so this is Romeo. I work on model cars with my dad. Japan, so this is K. My mom and I read mystery books together. This is where I sleep. Peru, so this is Ribaldo. I sleep on whip planks with three folded blankets for padding next to my sister. Italy, so this is Romeo. I sleep in my own room on a wooden bed with a down blanket I only use during the winter. Iran, so this is Kian. I sleep in my own room on a wooden bed with my favorite blanket. Japan, so this is K. I sleep on a futon on the floor next to my sister. India, so this is Anna, Ananya. I sleep on a huge bed next to my sister and parents. Uganda, so this is Daphne. I sleep on a wooden bed under a mosquito net in a room I share with my parents. Russia, so this is Olg. I sleep on a lofted bed in a room I share with my younger brother. This is my night sky. These are the families. So here's Kian with his parents and his little brother. Here's Anya. Where's Rivaldo? There's Rivaldo. Here's Kay. Here's Romeo. There's Daphne. And there's Og. And then these are just a bunch of words in our glossary. And yeah. Isn't that cool? Where everyone comes from. Okay.